Hi, I'm Steve Good, and this is a demonstration of the Scroll Saw Pattern Printer version 1.1. I uh, wanted to take you through some of the features of this program today and uh, give you a little demonstration of how it works. The Scroll Saw Pattern Printer does one thing and one thing only, and that is it creates ready to print and saw nameplate patterns. And I'm just going to take you through a quick little demonstration here of how to use it. Um, first of all, the areas of the screen that uh, and how they work. This is the area where you'll input your text. This is the actual sheet of paper uh, to give you an idea of how your pattern is going to print onto the paper. Uh, of course, you have your menu buttons up here. This is your sizing tool. Uh, you can select the uh, uh, font that you want to use from the three available fonts. Here's a list of the uh, top 300 uh, American male names and a list of the top uh, 300 American female names just to uh, you know, give you a quick uh, input to that. I'll go ahead and uh, type my name on the screen just to give you an idea of how this works. There is a completed pattern ready to print and cut. Now there's a couple other features to this pattern that I'd like to show you just real quick. First of all, uh, two of the keys have been remapped on the keyboard. The period key and the forward slash key. So if I want to start this pattern with a little decorative uh, beginning, I can hit the period key, which will put that symbol on the screen. Then I can go ahead and type my name back in again and hit the forward slash key to give you an ending to that pattern. So that's how you would get the pattern on the screen. This slider right here controls the size of the pattern. So you can see I can move it up and over here in my interactive uh, paper window, you can see how that pattern is going to fit on the on the piece of paper as it's printed. So you can set the size you need. Um, this particular button right here will clear the pattern so you can start over. This pattern will allow you to change the or the button will allow you to change the color of the pattern. Um, I usually cut light gray. That's what I'm used to. But anyway you can change the uh, uh, color of the pattern you cut. Once you get ready, go ahead and push the print button. Your print dialog will come up. You can set your properties and go ahead and print your pattern and you're ready to cut. Put a decorative little base below this and uh, you're good to go. The Scroll Saw Pattern Printer is donationware. Um, you can download and use this uh, program for free. If you would like to contribute to my efforts, there's a link right here at the bottom right hand corner of the screen titled Donation. Go ahead and click that button and it will take you to uh, my PayPal account where you can uh, donate $5 uh, for this program. The other link right here is a link to the Scroll Saw Workshop, which is a blog that uh, I manage uh, about scroll saws. And if you'd like to come over and download free patterns, watch some video demonstrations, and just generally have a good time with your scroll saw, please visit that site. Thanks for watching this video, and I uh, hope you enjoy the program, and uh, we'll catch you later. Thanks.